You can carry a lot of those at least. Actually, that's a ton of water. A water ball carries three days worth of water. And you can carry 99 of those. Yeah. It's You'd be able to carry enough for a small colony. Dude, fill your ghost up with water bottles, flood a planet. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> That's amazing. That so, someone do the research. What's the minimum amount of water you need to survive for three days? How? 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 Okay. Um, the average human needs to consume. Uh, water bottles four days. Water per day. Oh, it's. Uh, let me check on this. Maybe check. Maybe it is four days. Let me double check that. You you put a seed of doubt here. Adventuring gear. Where's water bottle? Holds four days worth. Yep, four days. Oh, it's also self filters, most common contaminants, dent proof, heat proof, bulletproof. Cool. So basically, you water just bottle find armor. That thing and you're fine. I'm going to make a shield out of water bottles, and then when I get thirsty, I just drink from it. <laughs> Road, I am. So you're asking how active you are when it comes to uh, your like water uh, water intake. I am thinking of bare minimum needed to survive. You are doing nothing. Okay. Let's assume that the well, water bottle is an emergency item and that's why it lasts for four days. You know how they put on the packaging? Okay. You know, yeah. lasts for four days, but it's only four days if you literally do nothing. But like if you're trying yeah. to survive out um, in the wilderness, it might last two. I do know that the recommended water intake per day is two liters. That's recommended. Uh, Mac is saying eight yes. cups recommended per day. Okay, so this is all recommended stuff. I'm looking for the bare minimum to survive. Uh, I would say about half would be the bare minimum to survive. So, Maybe even a quarter. I, I don't know. I'm thinking half a... Like... A, hmm. Like, you can go a long fucking time without water. Well, you can go, like... like if, if you're not very active and you, like... Make sure that every action you take is ri like actually has um, value towards your survival. It's then... three minutes without air, three days without water, three weeks without food, roughly. So uh, three days minimum, without water. The minimum of water you need per day to survive without becoming sick is one liter. Okay, so half the recommended. Yeah. Okay. okay. Uh, Let's just say one liter. So that means that that's a four liter bottle. Yes. That's a huge fucking bottle! And it's dead proof! That's a club! <laughs> <laughs> Not even if it's filled with water. If it's filled with water, that's like so damaging. That's a huge so amount of What are you saying? We're gonna I go kill some hive with, go. <laughs> with a water bottle. <laughs> oh my god! Forget guns. Forget hive swords attack. or anything. <laughs> Three minutes of air. Club. Yeah, we could hold ninety nine of those, right? So that's like freaking three hundred and ninety six liters of water, right? That's a ton of water. And now you can and fit. I, that's in one and block. I can fit forty five blocks. So times that's like hold on. Let me do the math. Three hundred ninety six times forty five. I can hold 17,820 liters of water. <laughs> how much Let's is an Olympic size? Planet. How big is an Olympic size swimming pool? Let's get a frame reference here. How big uh, is an Olympic uh, Oh, Jen already. Two and a half million. <laughs> Jen, Jen says, an, actually, no, that's right. Olympic actually doesn't have a standard. It's only a standard for depth. Or not depth. It's a standard for like one length of distance. That's it. So the rest is actually variable. So Olympic is actually isn't good. Uh, Jen says an average 18 foot pool takes 7,600 gallons of water. Isn't that much water? I don't know if uh, I can start a pool with my ghost alone. Just imagine opening up a faucet on your ghost and just water. <laughs> just spews everywhere. Well, according to this, it's two and a half million liters of water goes into an Olympic swimming pool. Yes. According to, uh, I found the because same thing. the standard measurements is like, uh, 50 meters long, 25 meters wide, and 2 meters deep. And that comes to 2.5 million liters. So, it's actually not that much water in comparison to an Olympic swimming pool. Like, at all. Yeah. So it'll actually, take a few days actually, to flood a planet. I, I, I'd have to make a few, I'd have to make like, hold on. I think we're digressing. No, this is very relevant. This is very relevant. I'm just saying it for 
Meta safe. We're trying to learn how to flood the hive out of the moon so we can just get the beacon and go. <laughs> and we might make the moon habitable in the process. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'd have to make 140 trips, but I could fill an Olympic swimming pool with 140 trips. Uh, with the six, or with the six, with the five of you, I keep forgetting I'm not included. With the five of you. Oh, five of us. Oh, that would be a lot easier. That would make it 70. No, not 70. Okay. 28 trips. Is everyone done with your purchases? Yes. <laughs> And the calculations, apparently. Yeah. Oh my god, that's a massive fucking water bottle.